Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is going to be the last Halloween haul for 2020. Um, so I'm going to show you guys some stuff that I picked up today and throughout the week as they come in the mail. So let's go ahead and get started. So if you guys are from Texas or taking a road trip through Texas, um, you guys know that Bucky's is like a big deal, um, at least for most of us. We like to stop there. The restrooms are super clean and it's just like a really big gas station convenience store. Um, and they have a lot of cute merch there as well. So I was looking for these last year and I could not find them because I was looking for them like super late. But anyways, I got them and they are the Bucky Halloween shirts. And they're so, so cute. They also glow in the dark. So this one's Jaden's. And it's so cute. I really, really like them. They kind of look like the ones from last year, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, I think they do. They're so cute. Absolutely love them. So I picked up the boys theirs. And I also picked up one for myself. Javi didn't want one. Okay. So now, moving on to Target. Um, I went to their dollar spots and I got a whole bunch of cute stuff. But let me start with Jaden's shirt. He loves... Paw Patrol, you guys. Was super cute. I got him a 4T because I want him to like use it next year as well. Or I mean, who even knows? Because that little boy is growing. Uh, but this was $7.99. I also ordered some stuff for Jacob because they didn't have his size today. So from the Bullseye Dollar Spot, I picked up this wooden witch little thing. It's so cute. It was $5 and it looks very like distressed and I love it. I also picked up this broom parking sign. Um, I picked up the little broomsticks from there last time, and this was $3. And then I got the little witch feet. These were $5, and they have the purple laces. It's going to look so cute with my Ray Dunn stuff as well. And then this wooden spider, which is $5, and it has some black on it. I think I'm gonna go back and get another one because I wanna paint the other one black maybe. This was really cute. And then I got the jack o -lantern. Yes, $5. I was like thinking maybe it had something to like string it, but no. I should have got another one. They had a whole bunch. You know what, I think I'm gonna go back because um, I probably am gonna put some of this stuff in the boys' room. And then I got the little mini version of the witch hat which was three dollars oh. okay so then now moving on to marshall's and home goods this is from marshall's this was 9.99 and there are these led ghost decorations and i'm thinking about putting these in my restroom because i'm like obsessed with the ghost you guys and then let me move this stuff I got these kitchen towels from Home Goods, and they were $5.99. Again, with the goals, but they're so thick, they kind of remind me of the bathroom hand towels. So I might end up using them for that. I don't know, but they're really, really cute. And then I also got this garland from Home Goods for $14.99 with the candy corn and the ghost. I went to Kirkland's and my Kirkland's did not have the bats I was looking for so I'm just going to order them online. Okay guys, so I have some more items that just arrived. Um, I got these really cute pillows from Amazon and they look exactly if not identical to the ones that are circulating around TJ Maxx, Marshalls and HomeGoods but they are just pillow covers and I paid $14.99 for each so i got two and they come like this they are currently um out of stock but it's by this brand right here so i would just um search um ghost pillow that ghost pillow covers that's what i did and these came up and i'm so happy with them so then i went to target and i've been looking for these ghost mugs everywhere and i finally found them and i actually did drive up 
So I got two of the Threshold little mugs. They're so cute. I'm not gonna actually drink from these. I don't think so. They're very tiny. Jacob was like, oh my God, are those for me and Jaden? I was like, no. But um, yeah, they're really tiny. I mean, I guess they're, they're kind of drinkable, but I want them for display. And these were $5 each. And then I also picked up Jacob's Halloween shirt because you saw I picked up Jaden one. He's super into Minecraft, so I got him the Minecraft one. I also from Target, and I did the drive up, and this was $8.99. Hey guys, so I hit up two more stores, and my sister-in-law found me two things. So the first store I went to was Marshall's, and I found the Witch's Brew candle. I'm not fond of like the candle scent or anything like that, but I did want it for the container. And this was $12.99 at Marshall's. And then I went to a Home Goods Marshall's combo store and I got this really cute sign and it was $12.99. And then I also picked up this sign if you follow me on Instagram and if you don't, you totally should. Um, somebody posted it and I found it at my local Home Goods Marshall's combo store. It's so cute and it was only $4.99. So love it. And then I found these really cute socks, some candy corn, and some skeletons. And then these two items my sister-in-law found for me. Oh, but let me tell you guys the price. These were $3.99. So she found me the trick-or-treat pot holder little thing. And then the spatula that says Happy Halloween. And they were $6.99. And the Hocus Pocus with the white spatula that says blue. Boo. So yeah, that's what I found for today. Hey okay, guys, so I got my Target order today. My little toddler is over here crying because he wants to play with them. But I got this really cute white pumpkin. They were $15. Hold on, baby. And then this green. Did you say green? Oh my god. This orange pumpkin. It's been a long day. Again, $15. And then this one, which I thought was going to be a lot bigger, but it's fine. This was $20. Okay, baby, I'm giving them to you. Okay, and then I also ordered some shirts from Etsy, and I got my first one. And this one says, support your local witches. And I will leave her Etsy shop name down here. And it's so cute. I get them super oversized, you guys, because I like to wear them with biker shorts and um, I've gained a little bit of weight, so you know. But yeah, super cute, and it's like a washed out gray color. Okay, so my brother's girlfriend, Samantha, thanks so much. She found me this gift, thanks, Ray Dunn mug, and I absolutely love it. The burgundy is so pretty, you guys, in person. So I'm so excited to have this and to add it to my collection. Hey guys, so I went to Target today and I picked up this life-size skeleton. Let's see how tall. He's almost as tall as me. He's supposed to be five feet. So anyways, he was $40 at Target. Sorry about the noise. But my kids, I'm trying to get this done. Um, and then I got this drape orange LED garland also from Target. And this was $15. So we're gonna see how this looks. I might need another one. So the next items I did purchase from Kari and they're my last items for Halloween. So the first thing is this boo mug with the little ghost topper. So cute. And then I got the haunted one with the little haunted house topper. And then the basic witch one with the witch topper so let me show you guys all together i got these from the same seller okay and these last two items were my unicorn for this halloween season and i finally got my hands on them i did have to purchase again from makari but i'm so so excited to add them to my collection and you guys the orange is so pretty in person um so yeah i'm super super happy that i was able to purchase these 
so that is going to end my haul um the spooky season is about to start we're a couple of days away it feels like fall here in texas um so i will have some more content for you guys i'm going to decorate my house and i will show you guys the house tour of all my halloween decor and i'm also going to be doing some spooky baskets for my kids so watch out for that video and we're going to be just doing some fun stuff um for this fall spooky season so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one bye